Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. How do I know if my Netgear router is working? You might need to configure your computer to connect one way or the other. Disconnect your router and connect your computer directly to your modem. Log in to the router. Click the Smart Wizard Test button to access the Netgear Online Test page. Under Router Status, confirm the router gets a valid IP address. What lights should be on my router? Internet, white, amber, the internet LED is solid white when connected to the internet. It blinks white while the router works to establish a connection. A solid amber LED indicates the connection is down due to configuration issues. Amber blinking indicates that the connection is down due to hardware issues. How long does Netgear router last? As a rule of thumb, a Netgear representative told us, consumers should consider replacing their router after three years, and representatives from Google and Linksys said a three to five year window was appropriate. Amazon, which owns the popular Eero brand of routers, put the range at three to four years. Why isn't my router connecting to the internet? Your router or modem may be out of date, your DNS cache or IP address may be experiencing a glitch, or your internet service provider could be experiencing outages in your area. The problem could be as simple as a faulty Ethernet cable. Why is my router not giving Wi-Fi? Resetting your router can fix myriad issues, and an inability to connect is one of them. Press the reset button on the back of the router with a paperclip for 30 seconds, and the router should default to factory settings. Use our guide to setting up a wireless router to get everything properly configured. What lights on my modem should be on? Should all the lights on my modem be green? The power light, downstream indicator, upstream indicator, online indicator, and link light on your modem should all be green. If your power light is yellow, it may be upgrading, so leave the modem on and give it a little time to do its thing. Why is my Netgear Wi-Fi not working? One of the most effective and the best ways to resolve issues like Netgear router not connecting to internet is by restarting the entire network. To do so, unplug all the cables attached to your computer and the router. Also, disconnect the router power adapter from the electrical socket and wait for about 2 minutes. Why is my Netgear modem not connecting to internet? If you're experiencing intermittent connections or slow speeds, your cable line might not have sufficient power levels. If your power levels aren't within the required levels, contact your ISP. Check your cable modems or modem router's firmware version. If you don't have the latest firmware version, contact your ISP. How do I reboot my Netgear router? To reboot your Netgear router, Open a web browser on a computer or Wi-Fi device that is connected to your Netgear router. Enter admin for the username and password for the password. If you changed your admin password, enter the password that you created. Click Advanced. Under Router Information, click Reboot. Why is my Nighthawk not connecting to the Internet? If you get an Internet Not Connected error in the Nighthawk or Orbi app, try power cycling your network. Your networking hardware might need to restart to establish a connection with your Internet Service Provider (ISP). If you don't know your router's static IP, contact your ISP. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark.